Hello everyone, welcome to Today in the NA. I am Vinny Paraselli. Another great week in the NAHL. We've got commitments. We'll honor our players of the month for October. And let's we'll tell you about the great cause we're supporting this month in November. Let's start with our commitment. Gurgli Oros of the Odessa Jackalopes has committed to the University of Alaska Anchorage, a native of Hungary has appeared in seven games this season for the Jacks, posting a 4-2 record with a goals against average of 230 and a save percentage of 937. Maryland Black Bears forward Gabriel Wessling will be taking his talents to St. Lawrence University. The forward from Sweden has logged six goals and 17 points through 18 games this season. Time to honor our stars of the month for October as the forward of the month is the NHL's leading scorer Christian Catalano of the Maryland Black Bears. The Mississauga, Ontario native registered nine goals and 13 points in 10 October games. Like we said, he now leads the league with 26 points. The defenseman of the month is Minot's Nick Ohanison. The blue liner from Troy, Michigan led all NHL defensemen with 12 points, three goals and nine assists in just eight games played. He now is currently second in scoring among defensemen with 17 points in 15 games. Then we've got our goaltender of the month, Arthur Smith, the Lone Star Brahmas. All he did was go 4-0-1 in October and stop 94 of 97 shots he faced and had two shutouts. I have a feeling we might be seeing his name again later this year. Once again this November, the North American Hockey League will be teaming up with the Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation. The Children of Fallen Patriots Foundation provides college scholarships and educational counseling to military children who have lost a parent in the line of duty. Since 2002, Children of Fallen Patriots has provided over $54 million in total assistance to over 2,300 children. Here's how you can help. Scan the QR code on your screen. It will take you to the NHL's fundraising page. Scroll down to the search bar and type in your team's name. When you get to the team's page, click Donate, fill out the information on the page, and then click Give Now. Your donation will help Children of the Fallen get closer to achieving their dreams of receiving a college education. From books to tuition, your donation is appreciated more than you know, and for that, we say thank you. Now on to the top series on the ice this weekend, Austin versus Minot. Both teams currently tied for first place in the Central Division. The Bruins have been a little up and down, but have points in eight of their last 10 games. Meanwhile, Minot is on quite the hot stretch coming off a sweep of Bismarck, and they are seven and three in their last 10 games. You can watch all 25 NHL games this weekend on NHL TV. Be sure to check out the league on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube. For live scores, stats, and updated standings, download the NAHL app. Also check out the latest episode of the Short Shifts podcast with Brandon Hofstra and myself. We chatted with former NHL player and Robertson Cup champion Ryan Coglin about his time in the league and what he's doing now at Mercyhurst University. That'll do it for us here on Today in the A. Hope you enjoyed the show. Hope you help our partners in Fallen Patriots. Come back next week. We'll update you on where we're at with that. And of course, bring you the latest from the North American Hockey League.